This video is not suitable for audiences under 13 years of age. Hello everyone, Mixed Gaming here. Welcome to my channel. Today we're taking a look at some of the black market openings. I have some keys here. If I go over to the black market, we'll see I have just over 6,000 keys. I will come clean. I bought one, a one 1,000 key offer. Oh, that came up. And the only reason I did it is because it is the black market speed up event and I was just over 5,000 keys and with the the speed up of the black market is 1.5 times which means if I had 6,000 keys I should be able to get to super chest and they have changed the stuff in the chest and the super chest and the whole purpose of this whole video is I want that bloody freaking cyclone I am tired of not getting it in the event after event after event. I grind out those damn keys, I mean coins, I should say. I grind out those damn coins, use them all the 400 uh, chests, and I still have not gotten it, and they keep giving me crap. So this is another way that I can hopefully possibly get it. Will I get it? No. There's just too much stuff in here. Chances are I won't get it, but at least it's a chance. Uh, that being said, they've also added some boosters into the chest so there is the, the ability booster here there's the damage booster in the bronze chest the durability booster and the shield boosters uh also looks like they've added some chips in here there's the the modulative intensifier is there any other ones oh yeah there's the uh, recurrent emergence defender the control resistor and the phasing renovator in the silver chest we have other chips in here we have the control resistor we have Kyle Rogers been put in here. We have the Sidekick Drone, the Resurgence Intensifier, Tier 2 chips, uh, the, uh, what is that for again, the Michelle? It is for the Raven. Oh yeah, of course, the one that looks like Lottie Rose. Doi. have uh, some paint jobs in here, another Legendary Pilot that I believe is for the Scavenger Griffin, isn't it? Well, it's just a Griffin, but it's it's kind of modeled after the Scavenger Griffin. We have the Defender drone. We have the Tai Morakri, which is the Spectre legendary pilot. Uh, we have the Fly. We have, I think, is this the, the Hades one? I mean, the Haichi. Haichi. The inhibited, inhibited Defender. More paint jobs. You know what? I've always wanted to pursue a legendary pilot. But I, I'm not going to waste my keys on trying to get it. Of all this stuff in here, like I already have the, uh, this is one for the Falcon. I already have that. More paint jobs, more. So they've, they've actually re, rejigged a lot of these chests, which is good. But again, this is really the, the 100, the silver chest, not really a target item of mine. I usually only open up those when there's a little bit extra that I have left over. And finally, we let's looking at the gold chest. So the Volt, the Veber, and the Gauss have all made it into the gold chest now. Uh, I believe they've taken some stuff out of here. Let me see here. Have they actually taken what I thought they should have taken out of here? Yes, they have. There is no longer the, uh, the Vortex in here, which is something I thought never should be in here. So that's good. They've taken the Vortex out. What I would like to hear are last stands. I, I still need another one or two last stands. I don't really care about anything else in here except the 5,000 gold would be awesome. Uh, this, I don't even really care about drones. I only run three drones right now. I, and I I can't even tell you, <clears throat> excuse me, I couldn't even tell you the, the microchips have on it. So I just, I really don't pay very much attention to it. I just, I, I've decided I'm not really going to try and play the drone game. Uh, I just, I don't want to be one of those people that get sucked into having to uh, just dump money into this thing. I'm just playing with whatever I get. 
Yeah, so uh, the 9,000 keys obviously would be great, but I've, I've never seen anybody get the 9,000 keys. And going on here, I you know I, I wouldn't mind another heavy armor kit. I am starting to get my Fenrir going, and I do need some heavy armor kits for it. But really, my, my main purpose of this is to get the, the last hand. But like I said, the, the chances of me getting the last hand with all this stuff in here is pretty diluted. I have absolutely no interest in getting any of these legendary pilots. I don't want them. I wish the... If you're going to put legendary pilots in, I can I could see them in the 100... Uh, the silver chests. Put all your legendary pilots that you want in the silver chests. Make the gold chest a little bit more substantial. The modules in here are awesome. But, and I, I know the, the legendary pilots, there's 2,500 gold to get them. And maybe they really should be in the gold chest, but you know, I'm just being greedy. I don't want them in the gold chest. Anyways, with that being said, let's open up some things here and see what we get. So here we go. Number one. And what are we going to land on? We're going to get the 10 million silver. Not bad. I would take that over just about anything else. Except for the last stand in the gold. Where are we going to land? The 10 million silver again. Off to a decent start here. Number three. Ten million silver again. I know Islander did a opening, was it yesterday or the day before? And he was pulling out gold, but I'm obviously not pulling out gold. But I don't care. If they give me a last hand, I would just be ecstatic. And we're getting the 10 million silver again. All right, two more to go. And hopefully I will have that super chest. So I'm not going to get the 10 million. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. This is why I said I don't want these in the stupid gold chest. I have two Thomas Mine Reeds. I don't need them anymore. Well, I'll sell it off for silver, but unfortunately, the the pilots, they, they don't sell for very much. I think you get maybe like 1 million silver, 1.1, 1.2, something like that. So really, like you get a 10 million silver, but yeah, you go to sell this, and you only get 1 million silver. Like it's, to me... The, the sell value is not worth it to be in the gold chest. All right, well, last one. Can I get lucky and finally pull a last stand out of this gold chest? And I'm going to get 1,000 gold, so I'll take the gold. If I got the 5,000 gold, then I could just go buy a last stand. But anyways, so we're in the super chest. So let's just go here. And fingers crossed, you all know my target item. Here we go. What am I going to... Ah, there goes my fucking suck. Oh, damn it. Oh, come on. Well, that was pretty pitiful. Oh, well. That was... Uh, I'm just going to say, that was, that was a waste of like the, the $3.50, whatever it was I... I spent to get the extra thousand gold keys. Not the end of the world, but definitely wasn't worth the gamble. And that's what it was. It was just a gamble. Anyways, so I'm going to pause it there. I will come back later in the month when I have some more keys to use for these openings. Well, everybody, we're back. It's almost the end of the month here. It is actually what day is it anyways today? It is the 30th. So we have one more day left. But I have enough keys here that there is supposed to still be going on a super chest speed up event. So with 6,000 keys, I should be able to get the super chest. We're going to, have, going to go ahead and open that. And I'm going to do something a little bit differently. Also, at the end of this, I am going to go into the gold tasks. The, one that, the ones that you can get extra gold by playing other games or other apps type of thing. And I've been working on one for the last six days and I should be just about there. So we're gonna hop into that. We're going to hopefully finish it and then hop back into the game and we'll get the gold. So I'll go for that in a minute. But first and foremost, let's do these chest openings. So let, let's go ahead and look at the, the gold. Do I want the gold chests? 
See the the silver chests now. They've they've added uh, boosters in, and I could use some boosters. And they also have power cells. Uh, I really should have thought this through before he even came into the video. The uh, this yeah the silver chest and the bronze chest. Well, yeah, the bronze chest has key, has some microchips in it. Also, it'd be good to, because my, my drones need a lot of work, and I'm lacking some microchips. So it'd be kind of good to get them. Uh, you know what? I wouldn't even mind that pilot, because I've been thinking of trying to get my pursuer back in, and I don't have the pursuer pilot. It's one of the few pilots I don't have. But the thing is, I really don't want aphids and geckos. has quite a bit of gold, some silver. As for the, the thousand key chests, I really don't need anything out here other than gold. A little bit of platinum would be nice, although my Titan right now is currently maxed out. But we, we all know at some point the Arthur will eventually get a nerf and probably some of the weapons I have on it will get a nerf. So I'll have to do a transition if I decide to play this game that long, that is. I really don't want to spend another year and a half trying to upgrade a, a new Titan, a new set of weapons. I'm just, I'm not going to be able to afford it. I'm, I'm not going to be spending money on this game very much anymore. I really need a last stand. Uh, I need a couple of heavy armor units because I'm, I'm leveling up a, a, a Fenrir now. Hmm. I, re I honestly really don't know what to do. So let's just do uh, a mishmash of stuff, I guess. So we'll open up a we'll open up a, a gold chest here to start. Let's see how it goes. And I get a glacier. I would have loved to have had that five thousand gold. All right, so we'll open up another one of those. Oh shit! Crap. Oh, well, well, I'm screwed. <laughs> I was going to open a mishmash. Ugh. I am really screwed. Damn it. Ah, uh, I wish they would remove that stupid button. Like, ah, oh, man. I only wanted to open, like, maybe three of those, and I was going to do maybe 2,000 of the silver chest and the rest in the bronze chest. Ah, crap. That really screwed everything up. Damn it. Not that I care what I get here. It doesn't really matter. Well, that will be sold for silver. Alright, so let's go back here. Go back into this and... Does this have any power cells in it? Or is it just the... The bronze chests. It has a thousand power cells in it. But there's a lot of other crap in here. I only have three shots at that. If I go into... Oops, I didn't want to go here. I want to go in this one. In this one, what do we have? We have boosters. We have a little bit of gold. We just have, have some other crap. Uh, chips. And some power cells. So, you know, I'm just going to open up the last 310 of this. So, let's just open up these ones. And see, maybe I can at least get some power cells out of it. And, yes, I'm going to open up all 30. That's remaining. I can't believe I did that. What a freaking noob. I, just, I rushed it. And I kind of basically screwed up my whole uh, plan. Alright, so we got... You know what? I wish they would just summarize what you got instead of just giving the, each individual item. Be a lot, a lot cleaner that way. Alright, so I have another 50. So let's just go ahead and open up another 50 of those.
All right. So that is the end of the uh, the chests. So what I'm going to do here, I actually have to switch devices, and I'm going to combine the the videos all together. The the uh, chest opening as well as what I'm going to do next. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch devices here and I'm going to pull up the current tasks that I'm working on. And then we're going to hop into the game and finish it off and come back and hopefully we'll have that goal. So just bear with me. I'll be right back. All right, everybody, we're back. I've changed devices here. And one of the main reasons why I have this on another device is I didn't want to have all these additional apps on my main device, clogging it down, taking up memory, RAM, uh, using up hard drive space. So I use an older device that I can still play Ro War Robots on, and I decided to put some of these gold offer apps on here, and then of course delete them afterwards. But what am I currently working on? So if I go into the gold offers, and it took me a little bit of a while to set up this device because every single time I went in here, the screen would rotate. And I, I'm really a stickler when it comes to trying to do decent quality videos. And I had to find a way to make it so the screen wouldn't rotate. And I tried turning auto rotate off, it didn't work. I tried installing the Nova launcher to force landscape mode, it didn't work. And then I had to go in and find an app called the Rotate Controller and it will force uh, the apps and anything in there as well to only be in the landscape mode or whatever uh, orientation you want. So if I go into the get here, go into here and you'll see in my in progress, I have the pop slots needed to complete level 33. And while on the face of it, that doesn't sound very dis difficult. Unfortunately, it was complete level 33 within seven freaking days. And the first day went relatively well, you know, I'll talk while I get into the game here. So, yeah, it went relatively well. I got to, I think, to level like 13 or 14 in uh, the first day. And then it just went all to crap. I mean, I, I think I got to level 18 by about the fifth day. And it was just, at that point, I had just decided, you know what? I was just going to give up. Give up completely. And then yesterday, I... I had, well, actually, okay, let, let me back up a little bit. For any of those who might be interested in the pop slots, it's, a lot of it is based off of luck. After the bit, the first two days, I was down to about 5 million coins. And, because uh, I was only at, I think, level 15 or so at the time. And I knew there was no way I was ever going to finish this. Not in seven days. And then I found that pop slots on their Facebook page, as well as Instagram, they have links to give away free coins or free uh, they actually call them balloons in this game so free balloons it's your currency and they would po post up multiple times a day you know one million balloons two million three million four million balloons and you there were there are sites out there that that store the list of all the codes and you could go back to sometimes up to tw uh, 48 hours before so i went in and i claimed probably close to about 30 35 million balloons and then at that point, I said, you know what, screw it. Yeah, I went in yesterday and says, this is going to take me a long time to do because as you get each individual level, it takes longer and longer and longer to progress. So I just sat it on and I put it to auto bet and I just, I just let it run. And I didn't, you know, one of the things about the slot games, you don't want to bet the big amounts. So I found in this particular game, even though I had, uh, you no know, 35, you no know, 40 million or so at the time, I was only betting 150,000 each individual time. And yesterday I just let it run and I was doing okay. And then I hit a, an, what was called an epic win. I got something like 75 or 80 million balloons in just really random luck. And at that point, I just, I, I just decided, you know what? Let's just run, let it run for hours. I just kept pressing the screen every once in a while to make sure that my device didn't go to sleep. And... Lo and behold, I got to 32. And so I'm just going to go on to the slot here. If you go on one of the slots that have multiple people, there is a, a social aspect to it, which means if you, if any one of the, the players here, myself or others, you see there's a free spin on here. If you get three spins anywhere on that screen, you or any of the other players that are sitting at the table with you, you get basically get free spins. 
So you, you want to do that. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to change my bet just because I don't know how long this is going to take. It shouldn't take too long. You can see I'm right on the cusp. I'm at 32, going to 33. But sometimes the, the progress up there isn't as accurate as it says. I could sit here for 10 minutes with auto spin going on and it still won't go to get to 33. So I'm just gonna put auto on and let's, let's just roll and see what we can do here. Right now, I don't care about winning. You actually get XP just by spinning alone. Uh, I really don't know how much extra XP you get yeah, I don't care about that. Uh, oh, I just leveled up. <laughs> well, to, here, here I thought I was going to have to talk for like 10 minutes while this uh, goes. But anyway, so let's turn this off. Yeah, okay, we won uh, a little bit of uh, balloons there. So we're at 33. So now let's just go back into War Robots and see. Hopefully it claims it right away. If not, we'll have to maybe go in and out a couple times. So close that down. Go into the war robots, and fingers crossed, I get my 12,000 plus gold. I haven't really been able to do very many of these. For some reason, there are times I start uh, I, I start one of these progresses, and then all of a sudden it says I'm blocked, even though I've never installed the game whatsoever. Or I've started the process, I've installed it, but sometimes because it takes so long to install, uh, once, once I open it up immediately, it doesn't get registered in the War Robots app that I've actually uh, downloaded. There we go. Nice. 12,480 gold. I need that. So we're up to 27,000 gold. So I'm going to keep trying to do this every once in a while. Uh, Islander had said that the, the slots ones aren't too bad, and he's right. But you want to avoid the ones that have the time limit. The seven days was just hell. I honestly, I had my app running for probably four and a half, maybe five hours yesterday, just auto betting the entire time. So anyways, uh, with that being said, I'm going to call the video. I hope you enjoy the content. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing. And until next time, cause some mayhem in the field for me.